What's happening guys, Oliver here from Smiley Reacts, here to react to the next episode of Fly Me to the Moon, Tontica, uh, Over the Moon for You, episode 6, news. So we're actually halfway through this season already. Holy crap, we're halfway through this series uh, season already. Oh man, it's just flown by, hasn't it? Oh my goodness. Alright, um, the other thing I want to quickly say is that I finally, finally fixed the issue with OBS that I was having. It was an FPS, so FF, yeah, FSP or whatever it is, um, <clears throat> problem, uh, yeah, FFS problem, that's it. <clears throat> and uh, it's all fixed now, so we shouldn't be having any more issues now. So thank God for that. So without further ado, let us jump into episode six of Tonkaka, uh, episode six news, <clears throat> pardon me. In uh, three, two, one. So the audience, she's finally sleeping in his bed. That that uh, chest though, <laughs> the way that uh, just the breathing sensation. <clears throat> Here we go. She's got it. Yeah. Sleep uh, walking. That happened there yeah, last episode. She actually got in with you <laughs> with him. Is she still? She's half asleep. So. Oh, uh, your arm is going to go to sleep, actually, now that I, real <laughs> I just realized that. Your arm is going to be... Uh, I don't think she's going to wake up. <laughs> you guys say it's... Because yeah, because she's your wife. What were you expecting them to be? Cold? <laughs> Pervert. Etchy. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> that look. Oh, that's adorable. And she's back down there. How did she not wake up from that? <laughs> you smooched her three more times. Good boy. Good man. Oh, go dear goodness, he hasn't slept. <laughs> yeah, you were too focused on... Her lips, I take it. <laughs> Not that I really blame you for that. But yeah, luckily they're married, so, and she probably, quite clearly she doesn't remember him, you know, groping her. So if they, yeah, don't do that if you, well, I guess in that sort of situation, if you do find a lady in your bed like that, well, hopefully you know who they are because there's going to be uh, problems otherwise. <laughs> But yeah, don't, um, it's called consent. Don't grope a woman unless she consents you, she gives you her consent to do so. <laughs> You need a bigger bed? I was taking the, I'm surprised it's taking you guys this long to think of getting a double bed. Okay. 
In fact, didn't they bring this up when they first, when she first moved in about getting, yeah, she, they did. They brought up the idea of getting a new bed th back then. And she brought, said that it's fine, I'll just sleep on the floor. That's a good point. Uh, it is a small place. <laughs> so. Didn't you already get a new TV? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. It is tiny, yeah, it is a bit cramped, but it's still homely. Bro. Bro. Rip that line. Best waifu right there. <laughs> Hang on, wait, what? King of the Pirates, Titans. <laughs> so obviously, uh, One Piece and uh, Attack on Titan. <laughs> that. Haven't <laughs> he's so innocent? <laughs> Live out the dream. Live out the dream. <laughs> no. And you'll lose a customer. <laughs> Damn! She's pissed. <laughs> you burn the place down. You burn. Wow. Wow. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> hey, wait, that's clearly a reference to something. What is it? I know that, I, also I know that reference, but I can't think of what it is. Why can't I think of it at the moment? Oh my. <laughs> All right. True, it does. A projector? That's not... That's not, yeah, that's not a good reason to move into another place. <laughs> I guess she does, that's why she likes films. <laughs> She's been sold already. <laughs> the, oh, she's being so adorable. Yeah. <laughs> 
if we fall, no, okay, she's being, she's sold. Oh, st stop being so bloody cute. <laughs> Speaking of your parents, we haven't actually seen them. You idiots. I have heard that they're not, they don't appear in the manga though, so. Okay, are we not going, we're not actually going to see them, but at least he's going to let them know that he's now married. <laughs> are we going to see here? Oh, this should be good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh that that's um she just got killed from that <laughs> there should be no problems i see i see there's gonna be no problems from that yeah i would like to hear this too <laughs> <laughs> double double hit double ko are they actually going to show up in the anime hmm well that's what i've been told i've been told that the parents don't actually show up in the manga well, at least his parents don't show up in the manga. So that would make a, a change. What do you mean by weird? Oh. Uh. He, she, she knows. <laughs> She's figured it out. <laughs> well, I guess th technically they're in the mother's in the anime now, but not really because we didn't see her face. <laughs> Damn, they seem to know exactly what he's thinking. Yeah, that's true. You can't change your parents, no matter how crazy and mad they they are. <laughs> how did you find out about that? How do you fi did you find out about that? <laughs> Meeting the parents is the honeymoon? Really? He's even he's thinking it now. 
Oh, okay. I get you now. I was wondering what they, like, just meeting the parents was the honeymoon. But going to their place is considered going. To, yeah, okay. I'm sold on that. He's positively sparking. <laughs> Oh, what's that? Oh, Ooh, okay. Makes sense. Yeah, on a holiday, you do need a camera. But is it, if you've got... Lots of people use their phones to take, to take pictures these days, though. It's very rare to actually use an actual camera. That's some commitment, but go for it if you want it, if, if you're, if you can do it. How is it a secret if your people know about it though? Like the parents now know you're married. Her parents know that she's married. So what part of this? Sorry, I don't get it. What part of this is a secret? There's, um... <laughs> Don't drop the camera. <laughs> Awakened in that boy that day. <laughs> He's become a photographer of her. <laughs> now these are some great shots. <laughs> I see this man is a, likes his thighs. He's, how many photos did he take? <laughs> I mean, the first picture. <laughs> he's, he's more embarrassed than she is. I love it. <laughs> That's very, very adorably cute. What is that? That statue. He is becoming so perverted. <laughs> it's a name. That's pretty. Yeah, go through absolute extremes. Again, how much money do you have? You've got like a fortune. You're rich. <laughs> That's usually what a night bus looks like. It's very rare to see, like, the person who tells you, like, the information about your trip on, like, a video screen rather than not in, rather than in person. She's very eager for this trip. Hamburger vending machines. I don't think I've ever heard of a hamburger vending machine.
Are we going to meet his parents, though? Uh. <laughs> they go. They literally go and follow them. What are you going to do about that? It doesn't matter that you haven't approved. It's not up to you. Yeah, they're not even related by blood. What the? <laughs> She's crazy. Ch Chishozi is crazy. She's, oh, she's already fallen asleep. Yeah, I won't be able to do that, even if on an overnight bus. Oh, you got your wish. <laughs> You're not going to sleep for the entire trip, aren't you? <laughs> it's, oh dear, NASA's just turned into an old man. <laughs> yeah, like she, she got into that accident as well and she survived. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. <laughs> that crack though. <laughs> Even if it was a joke, but still. I wonder how long it's going to take for Chirozi and those two maids to uh, catch up. Oh, they've already caught up. <laughs> She's not, Chirozi's not even looking. No, you have no human empathy. <laughs> 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 good luck with that, Chishozi. Seriously, good luck with that, because you're going to need it. Considering the fact, I have a feeling that uh, Tonkika is not going to be very happy with you when she finds out what you're up to. So, it looks like uh, you have a death risk, Chishozi. But seriously, can these two get any more cute? I don't think so. I think we have reached peak cuteness. Peak adorableness. Okay. Okay. We'll see how that goes for you, Jose. You're going to have to have a very good excuse to run into them <laughs> next episode. But this episode was, again, very adorable. So, we, I don't, so I have heard, as I said earlier, I have heard that the parents, well, at least uh, NASA's parents don't show up in the manga. I'm starting to think, is that actually 
not the case and that they really do show up? I'm not sure. But uh, obviously, because I haven't read it. But yeah, this has been uh, very a very great episode of Tonka Over the Moon for you, episode six. Please let me know your thoughts of this episode in the comments section below, and I will see you soon for some more reactions, guys. Have a good day as always. Bye.